Uh, last October, Emmett um, accidentally swallowed a button battery that came from our remote control at home, and um, he was rushed here into the OR to remove the battery, and it's been pretty much a battle to save his life ever since. A child comes to the hospital that doesn't stop being a child just because he comes in for treatment. Whether you're three years old or 13 years old, to be able to play is as good a medicine as anything that we can give in a pill or a shot. Being able to um, help your child make the best of the day with toys that are acceptable for his age and um, developmentally um, makes a big difference for them to just see a smile on their face, whether it's a coloring book or um, a pop-up toy or a train set. Child Life Centers tend to be the hub of a hospital. It's where people come to have family time, where kids come to play and to be kids. Oftentimes in a hospital setting, those choices are taken away from families. A Child Life Center makes it possible for a family to be a family again and for a child to be a child. We are raising money in all of our stores for hundreds of local hospitals throughout the United States and Canada. 100% of the proceeds are directly donated to the child life departments and they're able to use them at their discretion. Technical things like iPads and computers, a distraction station for our treatment rooms. Sensory equipment that normally we wouldn't be able to afford on our own. We were able to hire a music therapist and the programming for that entire music therapy program. We were inspired to develop Spirit of Children just thinking about what we could give back to our local communities. And the idea came up and was to throw a Halloween party at a hospital. It's an escape for all of us, especially for kids. We just have a great day um, making Halloween bags, they get treats, they can do trick-or-treating on their floor with the nurses, and so it just it makes a huge difference in their day, especially since they feel like you know they've kind of lost out on the Halloween that they're normally going to have. Once they're here in the hospital and they get to see what our Halloween is, they love it. It's attending to a child's heart and a child's mind, and for that period of time, it's just a wonderful transport back to childhood. You know, kids just aren't supposed to be in hospitals. They aren't supposed to be sick. And this gives them an ability to go just be kids.